Sensors are generally classified into two types. A contact type sensor and a non-contact type sensor. A proximity sensor is a non-contact type sensor. Means it can sense the objects not even by touching them. In this video, we are going to learn about What is a capacitive proximity sensor? What are its applications? What are its components? And how it's working? Welcome to Mr. Smart. Subscribe and support us in providing more contents like this to you. A capacitive proximity sensor is a non-contact type sensor, which works based on capacitance principle. To learn more about capacitance and capacitor, watch our previous video. Link is in description. A capacitive proximity sensor is used in many applications at industry. Detecting the liquid level in a bottle. Detecting the presence of metal cap over the bottle and detecting a movement of cardboard boxes over the conveyor systems. In all these applications, a capacitive proximity sensor can be used. So, a capacitive proximity sensor can be used to sense a metals such as bottle caps, non-metals such as cardboard boxes, and any kind of materials such as liquid level. The major components of a capacitive proximity sensors are housing, Terminal wires, capacitive plates, control unit, detection circuits, and output circuit. The capacitive proximity sensor has two conductive plates positioned close to each other but not touching. It is connected to a unit called a control unit. And control unit is like the brain of the sensor. It controls the flow of electricity to the capacitive plates. When an electrical current is applied to these plates, they create an electric field between them. This electric field extends beyond the surface of the sensor. The control unit is connected with the circuits called a detection circuits. A detection circuit is like eyes of the sensor. It constantly measures the strength of the electric field between the plates. When there are no objects nearby, the electric field between the plates remains stable and the sensor measures a baseline capacitance value. When an object gets close, it disturbs this field and the detection circuit notices the change. Based on the detected capacitance change, the output circuit generates an output signal. This signal indicates the presence or absence of an object within the sensor's detection range. The output signal can be used to trigger various actions such as turning on an indicator light or sending a signal to a control system. All these components are enclosed by a housing. Housing is the outer covering of the sensor. It protects all the circuits inside from things like moisture, dust, and physical damage. Connector or terminal is the part through which the sensor transmits the signal to the control systems such as PLCs or relays. Typically, the terminal or connector consists of four or three wires. In a four-wire connector, two provides signal and two provides power supply for working of internal components. In a three-wire connector, one provides signal and two provides power supply for working of internal components. Hope you have learned about capacitive proximity sensors, its components and working in detail. Like, subscribe and press the bell button to get more contents like this instantly. Thanks for watching.